So my name is Nalasha Ghosh and I'm an attending rheumatologist here at HSS. So I consider myself a general rheumatologist and so I kind of see the whole spectrum of what we consider to be rheumatic disease. And some of those things include uh, inflammatory arthritis. You may have heard of rheumatoid arthritis or a psoriatic arthritis. But then I also see other conditions that kind of fall along a different spectrum of rheumatic diseases such as lupus or Sjogren's and myositis. So the first time a patient comes to see me, it's really just getting a sense of who the patient is and what they've been through. Oftentimes, you know, they've waited a really long time or they've seen multiple specialists before they've seen me. And so I really just wanna get a sense of uh, their condition and the, the symptoms that they're having. And so it's a lot of me asking questions and just listening and having the patient kind of tell me anything that they think is relevant. One of the reasons I went into rheumatology was to be able to establish these really long relationships with patients. You know, I, I really like getting to know not just the patient and, and the condition that they're being treated for, but everything about that patient, you know, how they're doing at work and how they're doing in their life and their relationships. And I think that's one of the privileges of being a rheumatologist and treating conditions that are known to be chronic. So my approach to patient care is history, history, history. And I think that is one of the most important things that uh, we can do for patients is really listen to their story. Um, I often hear sometimes patients feeling dismissed and that's why I really take that first visit to just really get the story and listen to what they really have to say. And the second really bit and something that I think may be falling on the wayside in medicine is a, a really good physical exam. Um, history and physical exam can tell us a lot about what's going on with a patient. And then just working together with the patient so that we um, establish a good treatment plan for them. When we're able to get the right diagnosis for a patient and get the right treatment for them, and we start them on that and they come back to me and say that they feel amazing, I feel so happy, I feel so glad that I'm able to help someone. And I often take that feeling with me and I take it home with me and I feel like I want to share it with my colleagues just because to make someone feel better is, is ultimately why we got into this profession in the first place.